Hello everyone, my name is Scott Griffin with Carlson Software. Today I'll be showing a new command in Carlson Survey 2013 with IntelliCAD. I want to start by going under Points, Point Utilities, Search Publish Control. I'll pick on that and you'll see you'll get a map of the United States here. Go ahead and maximize my screen. On the right hand side you'll see Type, Order, and Stability. And then you'll have the symbol size, which I'll move it to a large symbol size here. I'm going to window in to Maysville, Kentucky area. And the way I do that is I just double click my, um, my mouse, which zooms me in to my location here. All right, we're about zoomed in here to downtown Maysville. Once I get zoomed in, I say search for control. It goes out, reads the information, and it finds the control points there. I can just click on the control point, pick on the identifier. It'll actually download from the internet the information about that point. You can see this is the Maysville Lewis and Clark Monument. This was set by Carlson Software back in 2005. It also gives you a complete description about that point. I'll go back out to the map. We'll pick on this one. We'll pick the identifier here. And then it'll go out and find its information and bring it in. And this usually takes anywhere from 10 seconds up to 30 seconds. Um, that's one thing I've noticed on using this. And you can see I've got my information on it from the National Geodetic Survey. So I pick OK. It's going to write these two points out to the Carlson CRD file, which is great because I can bring these points back into CAD and I can use these points. And I could also take these points out to ServeCE to use those control points in the field. So right now it's obtaining the information and it's, going to, it's writing it to my CRD file. And this usually takes anywhere from 30 seconds to a minute. Depends on how many stations you have. This one's just about completed, I believe. All right, it's finished. Now I go to points, and I go, uh, before I go to uh, draw locate, I want to make sure that you always go to settings, drawing setup, and you set up your projection, state plane 83 with Kentucky North for my project here. I'll go ahead and go to draw locate and I'll say draw all. It draws my two points on the screen but if you look here it gives me the information Maysville Lewis and Clark Monument. So it actually has the information right there. So let's go make sure this is in the right location. So let's go out to Google Earth and I'll go ahead and pick OK. And it's going to write out a KMZ file which I'll just call this uh, KY for Kentucky. I already made one before so I'll overwrite it. I'll go ahead and window these two points in. And it's going to launch Google Earth. And it's going to place the points in Google Earth. Now this is something that's new in 2013 that you don't have to have line work to bring in the Google Earth. This will actually just bring in points, which you can see right here. And I can look at my site. I know the site pretty well. And I can see my um, control points set there. Something else you can always do in Google Earth is grab the little man, take him and put him onto the street, and when you do that, you can see where the monument is set. It's in the sidewalk. Well, this concludes my demonstration for today. Uh, if you have any questions, please contact your dealer or your uh, Carlson salesperson. Thank you.